Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this stock report for Mullen Automotive. The report was first published on our website Wednesday, August 3, 2022, but this is a more detailed version. Our aim is to help you answer the question, should I buy or sell Mullen Automotive? In this video, you will get insight into the technical and fundamental situation and future price predictions. Please remember to subscribe, hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new updated video. Since July 12, 2022, our system ranks the Mullen Automotive stock as a sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 2.732. In this period the stock has had a loss of minus 16.84%. This is an average return of minus 0.99% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Mullen Automotive our last headline reads, Green Day on Wednesday for Mullen Automotive stock after gaining 0.84%. The Mullen Automotive stock price gained 0.84% on the last trading day, Wednesday, August 3, 2022, rising from 92 cents to 92 cents. And has now gained four days in a row. It will be exciting to see whether it manages to continue gaining or take a minor break for the next few days. During the day the stock fluctuated 5.37% from a day low at 91 cents to a day high of 96 cents. The price has fallen in 5 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 15.31% for this period. Volume fell on the last day by minus 12 million shares and in total, 41 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $38.25 million. You should take into consideration that falling volume on higher prices causes divergence and may be an early warning about possible changes over the next couple of days. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $15.90 and the lowest price was $0.52. Cents. Right now the price is 94.19%, or $14.98, below 52-week high at $15.90, which also is all-time high for the stock. The stock lies in the middle of a very wide and falling trend in the short term and further fall within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend indicates a possible minus 8.97% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 34.79% and 50.83%. The 12-month trend it indicates a minus 96.24% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 100% and minus 98.70%. This equals a price between $0 and $0.0120 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets From analysts Mullen Automotive stock received a general neutral rating. The analysts give P-E ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the Mullen Automotive stock and strong sell rating. In this section we will give you some information about signals found for Mullen Automotive. We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the stock. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Friday, July 29, 2022, and so far it has risen 16.45%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Volume fell during the last trading day despite gaining prices. This causes a divergence between volume and price and it may be an early warning. The stock should be watched closely. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The Mullen Automotive stock holds a buy signal from the short-term moving average, at the same time, however, the long-term average holds a general sell signal. Since the long-term average is above the short-term average there is a general sell signal in the stock giving a more negative forecast for the stock. On further gains, the stock will meet resistance from the long-term moving average at $1.11. On a fall, the stock will find some support from the short-term average at $0.86. Cents. A breakup through the long-term average will give another buy signal, while a fall below the short-term average will add another sell signal and strengthen the general signal. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a buy signal. Pivots gave a buy signal four days ago. Bollinger gave a buy signal not applicable days ago. The short-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a buy signal three days ago. The long-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a buy signal 19 days ago. 
the relation between the short and the long moving averages in the three month chart gave a buy signal 23 days ago. If we look at the 12 month chart, we see short moving average gave a sell signal 10 days ago. The long term moving average gave a sell signal 146 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages gave a buy signal 143 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Mullen Automotive On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level from accumulated volume at $0.87 cents and $0.87. Cents. There is natural risk involved when a stock is testing a support level, since if this is broken, the stock then may fall to the next support level. In this case, Mullen Automotive finds support just below today's level at $0.87. Cents. If this is broken, then the next support from accumulated volume will be at $0.87 cents and $0.87. Cents. This stock may move very much during the day, volatility, and with a very large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be very high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $0.0489 between high and low, or 5.37%. For the last week, the stock has had a daily average volatility of 10.49%. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, Mullen Automotive meets first resistance at 99 cents. If you do not hold Mullen Automotive shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn Mullen Automotive finds first level of support at 87 cents and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. In the table we have listed other potential swing trading levels based on the, the famous Fibonacci model. The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for Mullen Automotive is neutral. Here are some of the latest insider trades. The five latest insides trades have been done by Mishiri David whom have bought and sold 1,691,097 shares or options in the company. Based on the 60 latest insides trades, we have calculated the insider power to be negative at a ratio of minus 7.145. In total, the insiders bought 3,511,155 and sold 3,740,179 shares in the last 60 trades. We hold a negative evaluation for this stock, no stop loss set. Is Mullen Automotive stock a buy? Mullen Automotive holds several negative signals and we believe that it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We, therefore, hold a negative evaluation of this stock. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For the trading on Thursday 4th we expect Mullen Automotive to open up $0.0076 and start trading at 93 cents. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. And remember to subscribe to the channel to get all the latest videos and updates.